I do want to get back to this breaking news right here. Take a look. Days after the U.S. government shot down a Chinese spy balloon over the Atlantic Ocean, the U.S. Air Force has now launched an unarmed Minuteman III intercontinental ballistic missile test from California in a show of nuclear readiness. The test launched at 11.01 p.m. Pacific time from Vandenberg Space Force Base that is over in California and the base telling Fox News all about this a short time ago. They do call it, quote, routine activity intended to demonstrate that the U.S. nuclear deterrent is safe, secure, reliable, and effective. A test launch displays the heart of our deterrence mission on the world stage, assuring our nation and its allies that our weapons are capable and our airmen are ready and willing to defend peace across the globe at a moment's notice. So again, this all happening just days after the U.S. shot down that Chinese spy balloon. Doug Luzader with Fox News has more on that for us. House members put their differences aside to make it clear that China crossed the line here after learning more about what U.S. intelligence agencies know about the balloon and its payload. The FBI working to gather and examine parts of the Chinese balloon that were recovered just off the coast of South Carolina. And what they are learning has confirmed the fears of many on Capitol Hill who question defense officials about what we know and what we don't. But the truth is we think we know what they were going to collect. We don't know. That scares the hell out of me. The balloon is believed to have carried sensitive antennas for monitoring communications and transmitting that information back to China. Some of the balloon's components appear to have English markings, raising questions about where they were made. But the president suggested that some of the concerns may be excessive. It's not a major breach. I mean, look, it's totally it's a violation of international law. It's our airspace. And once it comes in our airspace, we can do what we want with it. The yeas are 419, the nays are zero. The House, though, saw it as a serious threat, voting unanimously yesterday to condemn China as the scope of that country's surveillance program became more clear. This is a, a, a clear and present danger threat. And many said there should have been a faster response. At the end of the day, I think uh, it should have been shot down over the Pacific Ocean, not the Atlantic Ocean. You don't shoot down a spy craft after it's done spying. Others defended the president's decision to wait until the balloon had crossed the country, saying the military used that time to learn more about how it worked. In Washington, Doug Luzader, Fox News.